Hallelujah. We give you glory this afternoon. Hallelujah. Come on. Let's let's raise the sound of prayer this afternoon. Come on. Hallelujah. We bless you. Hallelujah. Magnify your name this afternoon. Glorify your name this afternoon. God, we exalt you. We lift you up. Come on. Hallelujah. We exalt you this afternoon, Father. We magnify you. We worship you this afternoon. You are the King of glory. Come on. Hallelujah. You are the King of glory this afternoon. We bless your name. Yes. Hallelujah. We exalt your name. Yes. Hallelujah. We magnify your name. Yes. Hallelujah. We exalt your name. Yes. Hallelujah. You are the great great I am this afternoon and we bless you. Yes. Hallelujah. You are the great I am this afternoon. Come on. And we bless you. Yes. Come on. Speak in your heavenly language this afternoon. Come on. Let's hear the sound of prayer this afternoon. I've been praying all morning. Come on. We seek your face this afternoon. Hallelujah. We worship you this afternoon, Father. We exalt you this afternoon, God. Hallelujah. We reach for you this afternoon, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come on. Come on. Press. Come on. So. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come on. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. We press this afternoon. Hallelujah. Into your presence. Hallelujah. We press this afternoon. Yes, God. Into your glory. Yes, Lord. We press this afternoon, Father. Hallelujah. Come on. Shake whatever that is off this afternoon. Shake your morning off this afternoon. Come on. Shake it off this afternoon. Shake that news off this afternoon. Shake it off this this afternoon. Yes, Father. Hallelujah. We shake off every weight. Hallelujah. Everything trying to weigh us down. Everything trying to weigh us down this afternoon. We shake it off. We shake it off this afternoon, oh God. We bless your name, Father. You are worthy. Hallelujah. Worthy this afternoon, God. Hallelujah. We bless you this afternoon. Yes. Hallelujah. We exalt you this afternoon. Yes, God. Hallelujah. We bow before you this afternoon. Yes, Father. Hallelujah. We give you another yes this afternoon, Jesus. Hallelujah. We bless your name, Father. You are worthy. Hallelujah. Abound or abase, you are worthy this afternoon. Yes. Uh, hallelujah. Wherever we are at right now in our life, you are worthy this afternoon, Father. Yes, God. Uh, we bless your name. Hey, come on, Mama Oshaya. We trust you, Father. Yes, Lord. Uh, we trust you, Father. Come on. Uh, hallelujah. We trust you this afternoon. Yes. Uh, we trust you. We understand that your word declares uh, that the steps of a good man are ordered by you. Uh, we thank you that I October is a month of order. That you are ordering our steps this month. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. You order our steps every year, God. Every month. But I thank you, God, for special ordering. That there's a special order in October. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. That you are ordering our steps. That you are ordering. Hallelujah. The way that we should go. Hallelujah. That you are ordering, yes, Lord, our direction. I thank you this afternoon, Father, for divine direction this month, God, that you are directing our path. Yes, Lord, that you are directing our path. Yes, Lord, that you are directing our path. I thank you this afternoon, Father. Hallelujah for your steps that you are causing us to step upon. That they're not steps of man, God, but these are God's steps this month. He shut it out under the Ocos under the outside. I thank you for God's steps this afternoon. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. 
that you're causing us to step. Hallelujah. That you're causing us to step. Yes, God. That you're causing everything and everyone that was stagnant uh, to move. I thank you that this is a month of motion. That you're causing, hallelujah, things to be in motion this month. Uh, I thank you now, Father, in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, that you're ordering our steps. I hear that very strong. Uh, that you're ordering our steps this month. Uh, I thank you, oh God, uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, that patterns of self-sabotage uh, are being removed right now. We break self-sabotage this afternoon. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Patterns and cycles of self-sabotage. That while you are ordering our steps, God, that we interfere. We rebuke interference. With the divine order of God for October. In the name of Jesus, we rebuke interference, even if the interference is coming from us, God. We thank you this morning, this afternoon, Father, in the name of Jesus, God, for your ordering, God. We are tired, hallelujah, of making things up, God. We are tired of doing things our way and throwing things together. So we thank you this month, oh God, that it is you that will do the work. Hey, come on, We thank you that it is you this month, God, that will order our steps. We thank you for divine connections, God, that you are causing us to come up, hallelujah, and connect it, come on, see, to what is for us. In the name of Jesus, we rebuke everything that comes from the enemy, every connection on God, every alliance that you have not divinely orchestrated. We cancel and cut it right now. In the name of Jesus, but we thank you, oh God, in the name of Jesus, that you are causing us to come up upon every divine connection, oh God, every divine opportunity, Father, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Come on, pray. He shut up our sick. It is sir. Come on, pray with intensity. We thank your father that we will not miss it this month. I hear the Lord say many of you all year have been missing opportunities. Missing open portals of opportunity. That when God, hallelujah, has opened up, hallelujah, a portal of progression and has opened the floodgates of heaven, hallelujah, many of us have missed it because we have been trying to do things our way and we have a structure in our mind of the way that it should go and the way that it should be and where it should come from. Hallelujah. But I thank you this month, God, that we will not miss it. That we will not miss it, Father, in the name of Jesus. I thank you, oh God, for ordering, ordering our steps, oh God. I thank you, oh God, that you're even touching our minds even now, Father, in the name of Jesus, that you're touching our minds, in the name of Jesus, touching our minds, even real right rewiring our thought processes, Father. In the name of Jesus, the way that we think, hallelujah, the way that we see God, the way that we hear God, I thank you in the name of Jesus that you are rewiring our minds in the name of Jesus and causing us to think like you, to have the mind of God, to hear the voice of God, to see the visions of God. We thank you, Father, in the name of Jesus that this is our season to ascend. That this is our season to go up. I thank you, oh God, that this is our season to go up. We bind every demonic interference in the name of Jesus that would try to keep us down. Hallelujah. When you are causing us to go up in this hour, we thank you, Father, in the name of Jesus. For what you're doing for what you're doing, begin to share this live, with what you're doing in our lives. Hallelujah, we thank you, oh God. Hallelujah, for what you're doing in our lives. We bind this spirit of distraction. 
even it was present during consecration last week. The spirit of distraction that comes to disrupt, hallelujah, the movement of God. This spirit of distraction in the name of Jesus that comes to distract you, hallelujah, from getting what you need to get mental distraction, psychological distraction, thoughts, in the name of Jesus, thoughts that arise, demonic thoughts, thoughts that were planted by the enemy, hallelujah, thoughts of fear, thoughts of anxiety, thoughts of panic, thoughts of worry, thoughts of insecurity, in the name of Jesus, we bind it this morning, this afternoon, excuse me, in the name of Jesus, we bind every distraction and every disruption that comes to dismantle uh, the destiny of the people of God. In the name of Jesus, we come against it. Uh, hallelujah, we come against it. Uh, we come against it. We come against it. Uh, we will no longer be entangled in a web. Uh, the web of the enemy. We will no longer be entangled uh, with yokes of bondage. We will no longer be entangled uh, by the traps of the enemy that are set. Uh, hallelujah, to distract us. The traps of the enemy uh, through people, through situations. Uh, hallelujah, that come to grab our attention uh, and distract us from the movement of God. Uh, we will no longer, but hallelujah, I hear the Lord say focus. Uh, we will focus in this season uh, and we will focus in this hour, Father. Uh, in the name of Jesus, calls us, uh, hallelujah, to keep our eyes on you, uh, to keep our eyes, uh, even as we have entered this fourth quarter, Father. Uh, we thank you, oh God, uh, that you saved the best for last, Father. Uh, in the name of Jesus, we thank you, Father. Hallelujah. That we will keep our eyes stayed on you. Because, hallelujah, you're causing us this month to occupy. You're causing us to occupy this month. As I was in prayer, that's what I heard the Lord say, occupy. I heard the Lord say, occupy while I was in prayer. That October is a month to occupy. When I began to look up the word occupy, the word occupy means to take possession and control of a place. The spirit of the Lord says that this month you need to take control and take possession. When you take control, you are then able to take possession. But where there is no control, there will be no possession. Hallelujah. The Lord says, take control and then you will take possession of everything that I have for you. Every opportunity, every divine thing that has been spoken over your life, every divine promise that's been spoken over your life. Once you get control, you will then take possession and occupy. So we thank you now, God. Hallelujah, that you're causing us to take control of our environment. That you're causing us to take control of our household. Yes. That you're causing us, oh, I hear you very clearly, to take control. Hallelujah, of wandering minds. Wandering minds. Those that have minds that just wander and wander and hours have gone by and you don't even realize it. You've just been wandering and nothing's been accomplished. That is the enemy's entry to your mind. Hallelujah. To keep you from destiny and to keep you from getting to where you need to be. Hallelujah. The Lord says, take control of your mind. Take control of your mind. Hallelujah. And when you take control of your mind, you will take control of your time. Time. Hallelujah. When you take control of your time, you will then take control of your future. Hallelujah. When you take control of your future, you will then take control of your purpose. And when you take control of your purpose, you will then take control of your destiny. I thank your Father in the name of Jesus that you are giving us strength to take control. I hear somebody keep saying it's out of control. It's out of control. It is not out of control, the Lord says. It is not under, out of control. The Lord says, take control. He's giving you authority 
He's given you authority. We thank you, O oh God, for authority. That you are giving us authority over our situation. That you are giving us authority, Father, in the name of Jesus, uh, over our environment. Uh, that you are giving us authority, oh God, uh, over our households. Uh, that you are giving us authority, oh God, uh, over our emotions. Yes. Uh, that you are giving us authority, God, uh, over our bodies. That healing is in our mouth. That healing is in our prayer life. Hallelujah. That healing is in our death. Declaration. I thank you uh, that you are causing us to declare a thing uh, and it be established. Uh, I thank you, oh God, that you're giving us the strength. Uh, hallelujah. The strength to take control. Uh, hallelujah. So that we can occupy the promises of God. Uh, hallelujah. I thank you today, God, uh, that you are giving us strength for control. Uh, hallelujah. To control, God, uh, our environments, our opportunities. Hallelujah. Through our declaration. Come on, pray. Wherever you are. Come on, pray. I got to get my Bible. Come on, pray. Come on, pray. Yes, God, we thank you for control. Come on. Out of your belly. Out of your mouth. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Hallelujah. 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 The Lord says, Occupy. Occupy. He says, Occupy. Occupy. As I was praying, Hallelujah. And the Lord began to deal with me about this word of Occupy. Hallelujah. He took me to Judges. Oh, He took me to the book of Judges. As I was in prayer, in my prayer closet. Hallelujah. And he took me to Judges 6. Hallelujah. Oh, Where he told, Hallelujah. Where he called Gideon. Hallelujah. He called Gideon. To be a deliverer to Israel. Hallelujah. And Gideon's response, hallelujah, when the Lord called him to be a deliverer, he said to him, Go, go with the strength you have and rescue Israel from the Midianites. I am sending you. The first thing you need to know, hallelujah, as the Lord is telling you to occupy, he said, I am sending you. That is the utterance of the Lord this afternoon. I am sending you. You're not going on your own. You're not occupying on your own. You didn't make this up, but the Lord says to reaffirm. Hallelujah. And confirm that I am sending you. He said, I'm sending you. This verse 14 it says, go with the strength you have. I'm sending you. And Gideon's reply was, how can I do this? How can I rescue Israel? My clan is the weakest and I'm the least of my entire family. Let me tell you something. Hallelujah. Many of you are not occupying everything that the Lord has promised you and not occupying everything that God has spoken to you because in your mind, you are saying, I am the least. There is an insecurity that many of you are battling with on the inside. No matter how much arrogance is covering it up, no matter how much false confidence is covering it up, many of you are battling with an insecurity that I am the least of them all. 
uh, when the, the plan of the Lord with Gideon, uh, hallelujah, was to make the least, uh, to make the underdog invincible. Uh, let me tell you something. Do not look at, uh, hallelujah, who you are uh, and what your rank is. What people have said your rank is. Hallelujah. And what strength you have. God's going to cause a divine strength to rise up in you that you may occupy everything that he has spoken over your life. Some of you are saying, I can't carry out this vision that the Lord has given me because I'm the least. There's somebody that has a plan better than me. There is somebody that has a strategy that's better than mine. There is somebody that's 10 steps ahead of me. I am the least. The Lord says, shut your mouth this afternoon. I am sending you, and you're not going, hallelujah, in your own authority, but you're going in God's authority, and you're going under God's instruction, and you're going under God's directive. He said, I'm sending you. And I will be with you. Occupy. Somebody write that on the screen. Occupy. Occupy. Go on and take control and possession. Occupy. Come on, come on, come on. Write it, write it. Occupy. Occupy. That is what the Lord, I saw the word flash while I was in prayer this morning. Occupy. That means do not delay any longer. That means that this is not even a season to sit. But this is a season to get up and move and occupy and take possession. That means playing dead is done. That means playing dead. Playing, playing dumb and dead is done. Hold on, I see but God says this is time for you to stand up and take your rightful place and to take authority and to occupy the promises of God. Every word that has been spoken over your life, if the Lord gave you a directive to begin a business, you go on and occupy. You go on down to, hallelujah, the Department of Treasury, wherever you have to go and put your papers in and get your business license. Hallelujah. And occupy. Hallelujah. And some people think, Oh, hallelujah, that's just that's just secular stuff. No, because God has called some of us to be marketplace voices, marketplace prophets, marketplace evangelists, marketplace ministers. Hallelujah. So the Lord is saying you don't no longer sit where you are, but it's time to get up and occupy. Some of you have allowed nine months to go by. And you're still carrying something that you were supposed to drop last month. The Lord says, get yourself up and occupy. Hallelujah. He says, get up and occupy. Hallelujah. He says that the Midianites were attacking Israel so bad. Hallelujah. That when the angel of the Lord appeared to Gideon, he was hiding. God says, you do not hide any longer. But I'm calling you to get up and confront. Some of you have been hiding from the enemy, trying to lay low and play it low, play it, play it smooth so that the attack will be minimalized. So that the attacks and effects of the attack will be minimalized. Hallelujah. Minimize, excuse me. So that the enemy can't find you and can't mess with you the way that he normally messes with you. But God is not calling up deliverers to hide. He's calling you to get up and confront in this season. You cannot occupy unless you confront what's in front of you. You cannot occupy until you drive the enemy out of your space. Hallelujah. You cannot occupy until you come face to face with what's coming against you. My Bishop Kenneth Moe Sr. used to say something. He said, when I war cry, that's not the enemy 
enemy coming after me, huh? but that's me getting myself up and going after the enemy. Huh? Hallelujah. This is a season huh? where you don't wait for the enemy to come to you, huh? but you get up and go to the enemy. Huh? Hallelujah. The Bible says that Gideon went into the Midianites camp. Huh? Hallelujah. And he overheard. Oh, Shabbat. I feel the Holy Ghost. Huh? He overheard one of the Midianites huh? telling someone that he had a dream. Huh? Hallelujah. And they interpreted the dream and said, this can only mean one thing. Huh? Hallelujah. That Gideon and Israel huh, are going to have victory over you. Huh? Can I tell you something? Even the enemy knows huh, that once you get yourself up and occupy, huh, that you're going to have victory over him. Huh? Even the enemy knows. Oh, come on, see. Huh? He even has an inkling. Huh? Hallelujah. That God is calling you. Huh? Hallelujah. To drive him out of your space. Huh? And you're looking at the power of the enemy, huh? thinking that the enemy is too strong huh? and that the enemy is too thick. Huh? The Bible says that the, the Gideons, huh? hallelujah, that the, the, the Midianites, excuse me, huh? hallelujah, that the enemy, huh? hallelujah, um, um, were as thick as locusts. Huh? So you're looking at how thick they are huh? and that they were too numerous to count. Huh? You're looking at how many enemies you have huh? and how many people are against you huh? and how many people are saying, oh, they can't do that. Huh? Oh, they shouldn't do that. Huh? And how many people are blackballing you? Huh? And how many people are saying, oh, no, they're not qualified. Huh? They're the least of them all. Huh? How dare they stand up and try to occupy huh? and take possession of this? This don't belong to them. Huh? You're looking at too many of them huh? are too num numerous. You're looking at the numbers huh? and how many people are coming against you huh? when God is saying, shut up and get up. Huh? Get up and go into the camp of the enemy. Huh? Hallelujah. And drive the enemy out of your space. Oh, Hallelujah. The Bible says in Judges, huh? that Gideon overheard them. Huh? Hallelujah. And when they begin to blow the horn, it says in verse, Hallelujah. It says in verse, glory to God. I didn't plan on saying this. Hallelujah. I didn't plan on, on, on doing all of this. Hallelujah during prayer, but I got to tell you what the Lord said. Hallelujah. That when they blew the ram's horn, hallelujah. That when they blew the ram's horn, hallelujah. That the Lord caused the warriors in the camp to fight against each other with their swords. It says, when the 300, God didn't use a bunch of people. This started off with, with tens of thousands, but God cut some people away. Hallelujah. And that's another thing. In this season, God is cutting some people away. Because what he's causing you to occupy, everybody cannot take with you. You can't take everyone with you where God is calling you to occupy and the things that God is calling you to occupy. There are some enemies, hallelujah, that are playing on your side that God has to remove. There are some enemies in your camp that are on your side, hallelujah, that God has to get rid of. As he's calling you to occupy this next place, glory to God, hallelujah. But it says when they blew their horns that the Lord calls the warriors in the camp to fight against each other with their swords. And so in this season, you're looking at how many, how many people are, 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 are greater than you and have more manpower than you and have more strength than you. Hallelujah. But when you begin to release a sound, it says when they begin to blow the horn, I feel God. When you begin to release the sound, the enemy will begin to fight against one another. And they, they will begin to fall. Hallelujah. They will begin to fall one by one. Hallelujah. So I want to encourage you this afternoon during prayer. Do not be discouraged by what you see. Hallelujah. We break cycles this afternoon. 
We break cycles this afternoon, hallelujah, of self-sabotage, of hiding, in the name of Jesus, self-sabotage, in the name of Jesus, where we begin to sabotage ourselves, sabotage our progression, sabotage our next place, we bind it, and we come out of hiding this afternoon, in the name of Jesus, we stand in the authority of God, in the name of Jesus. Jesus, we stand in the authority. We stand in the authority. We stand in the authority. We don't look at our lack, hallelujah, but we go in God's power. We don't rely on self-sufficiency in this season, hallelujah, but we're going, hallelujah, in the strength and power of God, hallelujah. We don't rely on self in the name of Jesus, but we're going in God's strength, yes, Lord, hallelujah. So we thank you this afternoon, hallelujah, that you're raising us up, that you're raising an army. That you're raising an army in this season to occupy not only things on a personal level, but to take possession, hallelujah, to take possession of what belongs to the kingdom. I thank you, Father, that you're causing warriors, 300, Father, in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, to operate, hallelujah, operate, hallelujah, and bring kingdom, hallelujah, hallelujah, to take possession of kingdom, oh God, in the name of Jesus, even those, hallelujah, that are supposed to be in, hallelujah, are fold, hallelujah, that have fallen prey to the enemy and have fallen prey to the culture and have fallen prey uh, to the sound of the demonic. I thank you that you're causing us, Father, uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, that you're raising up an army, Father. Uh, hallelujah, to bring people back. Uh, hallelujah, to bring souls, snatch souls back, Father, uh, in the name of Jesus, even those. Uh, hallelujah, even those that have been consumed. Uh, hallelujah, by the enemy, I thank you, Father, uh, that you're causing us to stand up uh, with authority, oh God, uh, and drive every enemy me out. Hallelujah. And snatch souls back. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, we bless you this afternoon, God, for confidence. I thank you that you're restoring the confidence into your people, Father. Those that are not confident in the name of Jesus, those that are not confident in what you put inside of them. I thank you for confidence this afternoon, oh God, that you're causing them to stand up in confidence, Father. Hallelujah, with a boldness and an authority, Father. In the name of Jesus, I thank you, Lord. Hallelujah, that you would begin to even stir up the gifts. In the name of Jesus, stir up the gifts in your people, Father. In the name of Jesus, stir it, O oh God, that the gift would bear witness. Hallelujah to the anointing and the call. In the name of Jesus, even as Gideon, oh God, put out a fleece, oh God. Even there are some today, Father, in the name of Jesus, that are seeking you. That are seeking you, oh God, for a sign. <clears throat> that are seeking you, Father, for a confirmation of certain things, oh God, that you called them to do and be. I thank you for the confirmation, oh God, that you would confirm, oh God, and reaffirm, oh God, hallelujah, and that their confidence would reach the level that it needs to be. I thank you for the confidence, oh God. The confidence, the confidence, the confidence, oh God. The confidence this morning. I, I can't shake it. The confidence, hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, that you would cause your people, hallelujah, to be confident. Confident in the gifts and callings that you have put upon their life, oh God, and the anointing that you have put upon their lives, oh God. We bind the spirit of rejection. We bind the spirit of rejection this afternoon. 
every spirit of rejection that will cause people to live beneath the place that you've called them to be, Father. The spirit of rejection that will weigh on people's self-esteem and confidence, hallelujah, and keep them bound and keep them, hallelujah, it's a demonic way to dominate their lives, the spirit of rejection, to keep them low, to keep them down, to keep them, hallelujah, from occupying the place that they have been called to occupy. We thank you now, Father, in the name of Jesus, that you're causing their confidence to be restored. Even those ministers, those men and women of God, hallelujah, that high spirits of rejection rejection, huh? hallelujah, through confidence, huh? through false confidence and arrogance, huh? that hide rejection, huh? hallelujah, through through arrogance and through through uh, um, 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 con uh, being conceited and lifting themselves up with deep in the inside, huh? hallelujah, there is, a, there is a spirit of rejection, huh? hallelujah, lying dormant on the inside, huh? where they have been rejected and neglected and abandoned, huh? hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, huh? and have been told what they are not, I thank you, oh God, huh? hallelujah, that you are causing, huh? hallelujah, the people of God to see themselves huh? in the light that you have created them, huh? hallelujah, you have called us in your image and in your likeness, you've created us huh? in your image and in your likeness, we Thank you, oh God, that we will see ourselves in the way that you have created us, Father. The workmanship of you, Lord, in the name of Jesus, that we would see ourselves in the way, yes, Lord, in the way that you have created us. Hallelujah. We give you glory, yes, God. We give you honor. We pull up every hallelujah word curse. Every word curse that has been spoken over the lives of the people of of God. Hallelujah. To keep them stagnant in their purpose. Every word curse that has been spoken over the people of God. Hallelujah. That would keep them in a place living beneath Father. Hallelujah. That would keep them in a place of constriction, Father. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, we pull up every word curse. Hallelujah. Generational word curses that they would be like, just like their their family line, like their mother, like their father, and that they would only make it to a certain place and that they would not accomplish. Hallelujah. What you've called them to accomplish in the name of Jesus. We thank you now, God, that every word curse is pulled up, Father. In the name of Jesus, God, as we begin to occupy in October. Huh? Hallelujah. We thank your Father huh? that you would even touch our bodies. Oh, shout out to the Lord. That you would not only heal our minds, not only heal our confidence, oh God, but that you would even heal our bodies. Heal the bodies of your people, Father. Heal the bodies of your people, Father. In the name of Jesus, we need our bodies for ministry. We need our bodies to carry out your work. We need our bodies, Father. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Come on, pray in the spirit. We need our bodies. Hallelujah to accomplish your will in the earth realm, Father. In the name of Jesus, I pray for every person. Hallelujah. On this live, and on this call. In the name of Jesus, every person under the sound of my voice. Hallelujah. Dealing with sickness and infirmity. Every person dealing with sickness and infirmity this afternoon. Hallelujah. As they begin to occupy in October and as they begin to walk out. Hallelujah. 
hallelujah, which you've called them to. I thank you right now, Father, in the name of Jesus, that as they are walking, hallelujah, that healing would touch their body. In the name of Jesus, even your word declares they were healed as they went. I thank you that as they go in your name, Father, in the name of Jesus, as they carry out, hallelujah, your purpose, in your name, Father, that as they walk it out, God, that healing would begin to hit their feet, oh God, hit their legs, oh God, hit their gastro area, oh God, hit their breast, oh God, hit their minds, oh God, hit their brains, oh God, in the name of Jesus, I bind every condition, for deliverance is the children's bread, I thank you for deliverance from every disease, I thank you for deliverance, oh God, oh come on, Saya, to the Holy Ghost, from every disease, Father that's plaguing the bodies huh, of your people, oh God. Huh? Those in the name of Jesus huh, that are dealing with health conditions, oh, shananandios, yeah, that are demonic attacks, oh, cold, shake, that are demonic attacks on their purpose. Huh? Hallelujah, those huh, that are dealing with health conditions. Huh? Hallelujah, that are work, that the witch, huh? hallelujah, has begun to pray against them. Huh? Uh, hallelujah, that every witch uh, and every warlock has begun to pray against them uh, and has caused conditions uh, in their body to begin to occur. Uh, I thank you right now, God, in the name of Jesus. Uh, hallelujah for deliverance. Every word curse. Uh, hallelujah that has been spoken over the bodies of your people. Uh, in the name of Jesus, we break it right now. Uh, we cancel it right now. Uh, every word curse. Uh, of cancer. I see somebody right now praying cancer on someone. Return to cinder. In the name of Jesus, every man every demonic altar set up against the people of God, uh, hallelujah, against their bodies and against their health. Uh, in the name of Jesus, we tear it down. Uh, hallelujah, your word declares uh, that you suffer not a witch to live. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, we kill every witch in the spirit. Uh, we revoke their power. Uh, we mess it up right now. In the name of Jesus, we tear it down. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, every spell. We disrupt every seance. We disrupt right now. In the name of I see a witch writing somebody's name down on a piece of paper and putting it in an altar area and praying over it. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We shut them down in the spirit. Every demonic voice, every demonic prayer, we cancel it. In the name of Jesus, return to sender. We return it right now. In the name of Jesus. Come on, you're not praying hard enough. Oh, Koba said, Every witch praying against your business. Oh, Koba Saya, Banse, Kedia, Sekanda, Bando, Rotan, Dadadabandio Saya. Every witch praying against your business. Oh, Kota Basia. Every witch praying against your ministry. Every witch praying against your marriage. We shut you down. We snatch your voice. Every witch right now. Operating. Atamansia. 
under the enemy. Coming against and storing up dissension. Storing up dissension and discord uh, amongst the brethren, uh, which is sowing seeds of discord uh, in the in the name of Jesus. We cut you off. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, we shut you off. We snatch your voice. The blood is against you. The blood, he cut out of the bando, Hoshaya. The blood is against you, he can't have a bando, Robo Sandera Bandio, Coranda Baha. The blood is against you, he had a bandio, so ready, the Asiki and the Oshandia, and the Oshaya. Some of these witches posing as prophets, he cut out of a bandere, Koshandera Bahaya. We shut you down, O Koman Saya Raban Soya. We return every prayer. Every declaration, every word curse back to you. And we command exposure. We command exposure in the name of Jesus. Oh, Kotaya. Come on, pray. Oh, Randi Asia. Randele vedi o korandai, shake hand di o korandi o sia, riki and di o son di o shande da bahaya. The fire of God be upon you. The judgment of God be upon you. The fire 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 of God be upon you. Shataya, come on, pray. Rikaya Mansaya, let's war a little. Ika la bando robo socorataya bansea. Rikaya la bande de vidia siki and di oson di osaya. Riki and di o coranda la bandi osoya. Zeleve di a sande di a kande de bokoya la banda. Rukanda la bande di a shake di a sia. Rikaya la bande de bokoya la banda la bahoya. Rukaba bandi osaya. Every reoccurring spirit, Hoshana Rabasia. Every demon that's attached, Hokoman Saya, that refuses to let go. That you've let go of them, but they have not let go of you. With the sword of the Lord, we cut the cord. Hokoman Saya. In the name of Jesus, we cut the cord. The attachment. The linking. We cut it, oh come on, Saya, and we separate her, oh Shataman Saya, we separate her, Riki Alabasoya, we separate. We separate. Rikaya Manso Koranda Rabaya, Riki Anderebe Korataya Rabandirio Sandiria Sia, we separate. We send the under of Oshaya. Shake the bansai, even witches that are at your job, even witches that are interfering with businesses, even witches that are interfering with churches, even witches that are plotting. We send you back to where you came from. We send you back. We send you back from whence you came. We send you back from which you came from which you came we send you back we send you back in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus every witch spreading rumors 
For the word of God declares every tongue that rises up against every tongue that rises up against shall be condemned. Every tongue that rises up against shall be condemned. I thank you right now in the name of Jesus that every tongue that is speaking against, every tongue that's spreading rumors, every tongue, every lying tongue, hallelujah, every tongue of defamation, uh, that it shall cleave uh, to the roof of their mouth. Hallelujah. Uh, see under the Oshaya. Uh, that they shall chalk uh, on their words. In the under the Oshaya. In the name of Jesus. Hashamansia. Riki Ababan Sokobaha. In the Nabandi Andiriasia. In the name of Jesus, that their tongues uh, shall cleave to the roof of their mouth. Uh, hallelujah. I thank you right now. Uh, hallelujah. That every word, uh, that every word that the witch has sent out huh? hallelujah shall be returned huh? hallelujah in the name of Jesus huh? that no one will believe huh? that no one will believe what's being said huh? and that they will expose themselves in the Hallelujah, people uh, that are not even aware that they are operating as witches. People that are not even aware, hallelujah, that they are operating as witches. Uh, in the name of Jesus, I thank you right now uh, that their words, hallelujah, have no power. That their words have no power. In the name of Jesus, uh, hallelujah, no weapon formed against. Uh, shall ever prosper. Uh, and every tongue that rises against uh, shall be condemned. Uh, I thank you right now, even those uh, in the Namansi, uh, even those that are not even aware that they are operating as witches. Uh, hallelujah, that they be silenced. Uh, hallelujah, that they be stopped right now. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, hallelujah, those uh, that are speaking, speaking against uh, and sending word curses against people. Uh, hallelujah. Hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, I, I thank you that they are canceled, that their words are canceled. That their words are canceled. Rekatabansai, rekaya la bandera bahoya, rukababan sokora dadabandiase. That the words of the witch are canceled. Oshaneraman sataya, that the work of the witch is canceled. That it's canceled. Come on, pray. Because what people don't realize is witches do have power. That's what people don't realize. But God's power is greater. And we have been given an authority. And that's what the Lord is saying. Exercise your power. They are canceled. Their work is canceled. Their work is canceled. Their words are canceled. We thank you that in October we occupy. Shekadabaya. Then in October, we occupy. That in October, we occupy. That we occupy. And nothing can stop this possession. And nothing can stop this possession. 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 The work of the witch cannot stop this possession. Bodily sickness cannot stop this possession. The insecurity of Gideon cannot stop this possession. <clears throat> it cannot, nothing will stop this possession. We thank you.
Now come on for these next few minutes. Give him glory. Come on, open up your mouth wherever you are. <coughs> come on, let's seal this. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Nothing can stop this possession. Oh, sheke alamaya. Nothing. Realabandoya can stop this possession. Shekayarabando, Shanadia Siki under the Okoya. Nothing can stop this possession. Yandarabasi and Robosi under the Oshan de Asia. I hear that very strongly. Nothing. Koba Babandi or Kodreke Arabasoya can stop this possession. Kididia Sandidia Kora Babandi or Soko Yaramandia say. Nothing. Shakayanaman Soko Rataya can stop this possession. Iki under your coat, Rataya Raban say. Koman Saya. Hallelujah. Nothing can stop it. Nothing can stop it. Nothing can stop it. It is so. It is so in Jesus' name. You may go in peace this afternoon. God bless.